Hey guys, welcome back to Explore Electronics. In this video, let's see the model question paper released by VTU for the subject microcontrollers with the code BCS402. This is a computer science branch subject. Coming to module 1, the first question is mention the difference between microcontroller and microprocessor. So this is a very common question you can see in any uh, question paper of microcontroller or microprocessor related subject. You can also see here risk and risk differences they have asked. Since this is for 10 marks, 5 marks will be for the difference between mu p and mu c and 5 marks for risk and risk. So these two questions are very very important. We have seen this question in other subject 8051 microcontroller model question paper also. Then uh, the question is explain the architecture of ARM embedded device with neat diagram. So the architecture diagram is also very important. It is repeatedly asked in exams. So in the first module you can expect the architecture and uh, you can see here the choice question we have explained in detail about the current program status register CPSR and with a neat diagram explain embedded system hardware. These are the questions they have given in model question paper and here they have given for 10, 10 marks. In exam you may get questions like 5 marks, 8 marks questions also. Coming to module 2, explain different arithmetic instructions of ARM processor with an example. So in coming to instruction sets, you can expect one question easily from instruction sets. Uh, they may ask to write the instruction set with example generally or they may ask in particular instructions also. Then we have explain single register, load store, addressing mode syntax, table, index mode with an example. This is also asked for 10 marks. In the choice question from module 2, explain barrel shifter instructions in ARM with suitable examples. So here they have asked barrel shifter instructions. Then explain different logical instructions in ARM processor with an example. So as I said, they can ask like this, different arithmetic instructions or different logical instructions or generally they may ask for 10 marks like explain different instructions of ARM processor also. Then module 3, Explain code optimization, profiling and cycle counting. This is uh, module 3 question asked for 10 marks. And write a C program that prints the square of integers between 0 to 9 using functions and explain how to convert this C function to an assembly function with a command. This is for 10 marks. This is we need to write a C program for this. Like this you can expect some other example also. Usually these questions will be given from the textbook which is prescribed uh, textbook example or uh, it can be a part of the lab program like that. Then the sixth question is discuss how registers are allocated to optimize the program for 10 marks. Develop an ALP to find the sum of first 10 integer numbers. Here we need to write the assembly language program to find the sum of first 10 integer numbers. This is also for 10 marks. So in module 3, you can easily expect one programming question for sure. Coming to module 4, with a neat diagram, explain ARM processor exceptions and modes. For 10 marks, explain assigning interrupts and interrupt latency for 10 marks. In the 8th question, they have asked, briefly explain what happens when an IRQ and FIQ exception is raised with an ARM processor. So this is again related to interrupt. Uh, briefly explain what happens when IRQ and FIQ exceptions are going to be raised. Explain firmware execution flow and explain Red Hat Re Red Boot. This is for 10 marks from module 4. Coming to module 5, this is with respect to cache memory. Explain the basic architecture of cache memory and explain how main memory maps to a cache memory. This is very important to understand the cache memory and the types and how it will be uh, the main memory will be associated with respect to the cache memory. Uh, then the 10th question with a neat diagram explain associative cache and the last question briefly explain cache line replacement policies. So this is about the model paper given by VTU for the subject microcontrollers for BCS402. Let us try to solve this model question paper and give you the solution as soon as possible. Thank you.